Rostislav Nastrov has a dream to go on a 17 game win streak with the Columbus Blue Jackets. I'm not gonna lie, our chances of that happening slim to absolute zero. But if there is any man in the NHL that can make this happen, it is none other than Rusty. Our win streak began with a 3 1 victory over our rivals, the Pittsburgh Penguins. After that, we took on a surprisingly good Arizona Coyotes team with a 9 6 1 record. And listen, I'm a man of the people. I see a petition with 500 signatures in the comment section i listened to it you guys asked for two games an episode so we are going to do just that i'm not gonna lie to you i don't want this video to be two hours long so we're gonna do a bit of shorter periods we'll need some help from lines two three and four but hopefully we can get two big victories and continue this streak also i apologize in advance i've been brutally sick the last couple days i'm still not feeling well but you know what we have a job to do michael jordan flu game is what rusty is going to bring to the table right here right now let's get into it our goal for this game is going to be to take alexander ovechkin out of each and every play i don't care what we have to do i've been getting destroyed each game so we're gonna do that exact same thing to alexander ovechkin look at that dude a booming cross check to start the game the refs have already lost control and we are 10 seconds in sick all right there's a okay the refs the refs are trying to get back control of this game <laughs> tom wilson head to the box with an instant tripping penalty this is gonna be chaos you can already tell now with the short periods i mean one two goals might be enough to <laughs> Pooh jenner with the no look backhanded half spin ew we finally won a draw in the offensive zone boone gets it right back and holy i don't think i've ever seen a, a shot like that out of boone what a finish we're up one let's keep this rolling dude i almost got in the way of that i'm not gonna lie boys what is going on i've never had help from my other lines and right now we are up two to zero in our game versus the Cavs. let's go all right hey let's not get comfortable here okay we we know what happens if they would have scored that shot, I, I would not have been surprised. Obviously, it feels good having a 2-0 lead right now. But at the same time, like, imagine we're down 2-0. With these shorter periods, we really do not have the time. Oh, what a save to try to, like, make a comeback happen. Okay, good little chances there. Rusty is absolutely buzzing out here. Try to get that up high. We are just throwing that puck away. But Kent Johnson laying the boom. There's Rusty laying the boom. And a great low shot on net from Rostislav Nastro. All right. Hey, we're, we're giving the boys some options here. We're at least playing some hockey. It looks like we kind of know what we're doing a little bit. Sick! Hit the net! Dude, he made a perfect move and had the entirety of that left side open. Can't find the back of the net. And it looks like another penalty has come. The refs are, I gotta say, this officiating crew doing an incredible job. TJ Oshie got the phantom elbow this time. Why is there a bio steal on the ground, by the way? You can put it up on that shelf for the boys, at least. Holy. Oh, it's because he threw it. Fair enough. Dude, that might be a 10 game suspension, that elbow. That thing was like above his forehead. <laughs> Of course. I mean, you would think on the power play, we'd be out there. We'd be buzzing around, though, that we let up a short-handed goal. It's two to one. Win this draw boot again, and let's get another... Yep. To me! I thought I was going to get an interference call there. I completely missed the puck. Bodied a guy in front... No, not like this. Not like this. Nice save there by Elvis. Absolutely bodied in the process, and we are going to go. Yep, beautiful feed. Little sidestep. Little double sides. I should probably never DQ again. Oh! The hand! Dude, I kind of like these quicker periods. I mean, we've actually gotten a lot of time just because of all the penalties and whatnot, but I'm kind of liking... Have the refs, like, turned a new corner? We used to not get a single call. We played three games, not one penalty, and now we're getting one every single three seconds. Dude... <laughs> Two goal lead instantly gone the moment that we go to the bench. It doesn't matter if we're even strength, if we have a power play. No lead is safe. We are back in twos, heading into the second period. Dude, I can't believe this. You got to think that the penalties are going to start to settle down. We also do need to take Ovi out of the play. I've yet to have a booming hit on Ovi. We're going to look for that here in the second period. Okay, good little pass there. I'm just going to try not to be the one to get completely bodied. So we'll let uh, somebody else take the big hit, and then I'll go right to the net. Fire that low. Dude, I keep getting robbed on the glove side, so I try to take it over to the blocker. We still get robbed. Nice save. Good pass, though. Rusty, we're putting the pressure on them. Don't stop now. Listen, we've been putting in the work. I've been dishing a lot of apples, but we need to be the goal scorer. We are going to carry this team to 17 wins, and you can only do that by scoring goals. Yep, what a win. To me. <laughs> 
That might be one of the worst blunders that I've ever seen Rusty make. <laughs> that is horrible. Nothing crazy here, boys. Nothing crazy. I'm going to stay up at my wing. We're going to try... We are now playing from behind yet again in, in true Blue Jackets fashion. Wow. The thing is, we've had so many chances. We have another power play. How many power plays do we have to get before? Maybe we switch up the lines. Like, maybe put me out there with Johnny and Line A or something. I don't know, man. There's got to be something better that we can get out here. All right, we have a little bit of space. Okay, a little bump from behind. Kind of helped me out, though, to be honest. We'll make that pass. Yep, boom, to me. Try to go short side. I don't mind that. I do not mind that. Keep that puck in, though. No one's there to keep that puck in. One minute here, boys. One minute. We have to score one. I'm going to sit up top. Boone. Dude. Boone is absolutely throwing. Did he get a... He did get a penalty there. Doesn't make the pass. Makes a dumb move in the corner. And then immediately trips him up afterwards. That is not a captain-like behavior. Give Rusty the C right now, coach. Take it off his chest and give it to me. It is, it is now 4-2. to two. Oh, here we go, boys. I think the win streak may be coming to an end. 4-2 to two the score. Wow. This is, uh, this is just... I mean, it's just disastrous. No easy way to put it. Feels like we've lost all the momentum. We can't... Oh, wait, the momentum might be back here, boys. Hold on. If we score this, this would be iconic. Shoot that low. That might that might single-handedly be the worst shot I've ever seen in this game. Oh, what a play from Rusty. What a play from Rusty. Go to the net. Wretzky. Oh, there we go, boys. Hey, we're back. All right, hey, we're going to... Quiet down the crowd a little bit. I mean, Zach Wierenski hit Kuznetsov over the boards, gets up the ice, and finds the backdoor feed. All right, this is what we needed. We are not giving up yet. I know it looked like we're down and out. No, we are right back into this game. We're down one. Should we be in this position? Absolutely not. I mean, we were up 2-0. We had plenty of opportunities to score mid-slot. Could not bury any of them, but the good news is we are fighting back. All right, this win streak does not end today. Lock that in. Lock it in. The thing is, no one else is playing for the win streak, right? They're just treating this like any other game. I'm playing with a little extra, a little extra on the line here. It is 17 game win streak or bust here with this franchise. Anything else and we're falling short. 15 minutes, but we do have to keep in mind. Oh. Charging! I took one stride. Dude, these refs, the, the refs have been paid off. There's no other explanation. I don't even think I took a full stride. That's half a stride into a clean hit in the corner. But of course, the refs doing what they do best and rigging this game. Oh! <laughs> Wait, what just happened? Bang! Let's go! Sonny Milan. Wait, I gotta pause this, dude. What just happened? So just taking a brief look at the replay here, this is what we had missed. So we got some of the boys just sitting, uh, some of the capitals sitting mid-ice as well. The puck then starts in this corner. This is real time, all we have. It teleports to the top of the crease, goes into the back of the net. Sonny Milano down there. I think it said Sonny was the one that put it in. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, boys. I have no idea. And then just to make matters worse, after the goal is scored, we have 30 guys out on the ice, including the Washington Capitals mascot amongst the Blue Jackets players. Boys, this is one of the strangest glitches that I have ever seen in Be a Pro. I have no idea what is happening, but it helped us out. So a 4-4 hockey game, still some time to go. Okay, I know uh, that was a bit of a distraction, but we do have a, a game to, to win here. And I don't even know if we deserve to win this game. Dude, that was wild. I've never never seen anything like that 4-4 four, four. these are the games that we have to find a way to win all right we are the ones that can boys it's gonna be like that you know i was just talking we, we gotta be the ones to set the tone to turn this one around and what happens they walk down walk around our defenseman and bury it into the back of the net i mean there's not even anywhere that he could go and elvis comes off the post and lets him bury it short side we are down by one everything on the line what a disaster this is Dude, if that would have went in to end our streak, I would have lost my mind. <gasps> what a save by Elvis. What? That is the save of the year there, dude. What a save. Okay, coach is leaving us out on the ice, but we actually have no... I mean, we have no energy and very little time. So if I go to the bench, that probably will be our last shift. Do I just stay out here? Okay, um, they are just... They are they are just killing clock here in the corner. We're going to go here. All right, Kent Johnson still has some energy. I have absolutely zero energy, and Kent Johnson throws the puck away. Dude, you got to be kidding me. The streak can't end like this, especially not after the glitch. And with a minute 52 on the clock, we are pulled off the ice. 
Do we have a little miracle in us? And can we get one last shift? We might get out there one more time. We'll see. We have 30 seconds, a slow 30 seconds at least. And uh, we unfortunately are going to have to watch the rest of this game from the bench. So 20 seconds left. Can the boys get up? Yes, they can. Hold on here. Texier, by the way. Oh my dude, mid slot and we get robbed glove side again. How many is it going to take? And with eight seconds on the clock, we need an absolute miracle and we will not get it. The Columbus Blue Jackets fall to the Washington Capitals. A disaster. The smoke screen is covering the faces of the players. A disastrous game up 2-0. We're blessed a goal with the craziest glitch that I have ever seen it be a pro. And we still cannot get the victory. Now the mascot is back on the ice for a second time, celebrating the victory with his team. And this one, this one's going to come to an end. The win streak challenge finished at two. I told you our chances of completing this slim to absolute zero. And just like that, this one comes to an end. I know a lot of you guys were worried about this season taking too long. If we were to go on a 17 game win streak, well, we don't have to worry about that anymore. We are going to go ahead and sim to today in real time so that we are up to date with the regular season. We'll start this sim and just see how disastrous the season looks. But of course, first we have to talk to Johnny Hockey. What do you know? Personal accountability is important. You said you'd get those takeaways and you didn't. You can work harder. Johnny, you entered the zone and turned the puck over 18 times that game. I am not listening to a single word that you have to say. Okay, at least he was kind of nice about it, I guess. But we do lose some teammate mobility there with Johnny. And over the course of the sim, we had a one, two, three, four game winning streak. The boys are absolutely buzzing. We were also in a playoff spot on the day of American Thanksgiving, which means usually you're going to make the playoffs. So the Blue Jackets currently sitting third in the Metro. Things are looking up for the boys. I know this game obviously isn't as hype now that we don't have our win streak going but you guys gotta let me know in the comments down below how often do you want me to sim how many games do you want to see an episode let's play our second game here versus the florida panthers and then we're all caught up to the regular season boys at some point we just have to be honest with ourselves 17 games in a row with how random the pro is it's just i don't even know if it's possible like I, I don't think the game would let that happen even if we go out there and score three goals a game we would still find ways to lose and of course, I'm going to come out here and score three goals this game when it doesn't matter. That's how it's going to go. But still a fun little challenge. And honestly, if we end up going on like a five game win streak just randomly in the season, I will. Uh, I'll start the. Johnny, why couldn't you do that last game, buddy? This guy is selling like he just won the Stanley Cup. Like, let's calm down here, Jonathan. But if we do randomly go on a win streak in the season, I'll start the challenge back up. No problem. And we'll see if we can get to 17. Will it ever happen? Probably not. Will we ever get to five? Probably not. But uh, we'll see what happens. 38 points? Dude, what? Johnny Hockey leading the league in points after that one, mostly because he's getting carried by Rostislav Nashrov, but no one mentions that. Okay, let's get a nice goal here. Okay, Johnny, you know, you're not giving me a ton of space. We're going to... Dude, I haven't laid a big hit in three episodes. Like, I just go into the corner and just completely whiff. But you know what I can do? I can wheel to the outside. Look at... Huh? Dude, oh my gosh. Just go in. I feel like I've just forgotten how to score in this game. Maybe it's because I'm still a 68 overall or whatever it is. But still, you just got to... You gotta find a way man come on okay the score now two to two johnny hockey has his second of the game and uh we are looking to get him his third why not dude i want to see some hats flying out to the rink here and you know what if it's for johnny hockey instead of myself so be it rusty's a team player you know i, I play for the boys here johnny i'm gonna give this to you johnny you owe me man your next contract well i guess yeah you already got your okay you already got your contract locked in i was gonna say if the contract wasn't locked in you'd be getting 15 million a year because of rostislav nastrov look at the hats flying out way to be it could he have done it last game that would have been preferred but still a nice finish nonetheless johnny hockey with a hat trick early three two one and johnny hockey with the hat trick in the first let's see it Give me a second Hattie in the second. Why not? Let's keep this moving. Dude, I want to get a big hip check. I haven't laid a hip check since like the first game of the season. I'm due for a big... Oh, hold on. Hold on. Rusty's buzzing. We're going to do a little chip tee. A little sidestep. Ew. Ew. Throw it on net. Hey, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's going on, boys. I'm just going to get off the ice before something bad happens. Hey, we got to give it up to Johnny Hockey. I know I chirp him uh, every now and then in the episodes, and obviously he doesn't play up to his full potential at times. But this guy, I mean, he's been put on a... What is 
was saved by mom. Dude, come on. I mean, Johnny Hockey, he's leading the league in points. He's putting up the goals even, even when Rusty's struggling. Like, we got to give credit where credit's due. He's playing amazing. Okay, no goals against. I don't even care if we don't score. We're just no goals against in the last minute of this period. Please. Johnny, want to play Johnny? Here we go. Okay, we're going to have a little two-on-one. I'm going to wait for Johnny to get back to one. We're firing it across. You're telling me that that's the point leader in the NHL after a play like that? Are you kidding me? That's what I don't get about Johnny. He scores the craziest goals in this series, and then you give him an open backdoor pass, and he sends it 10 feet wide parallel to the goal line. It makes no sense. Okay, one period left. We have a lead, but obviously we're used to having leads. You know, I had a 2-0 lead against the Washington Capitals at one point. We know how that went. Hey, I just want the record to show if we get scored on here, it's entirely on coach. He's the one leaving us out here for four-minute shifts. All right? We could be smarter, you know, send, send all the lines out there, but no, I'm going to get off the ice here. I got no energy left. Okay, we're being smart. There just has to be a couple. Okay, let's go. One goal each shot. We have a 4-3 hockey game. I'm telling you, you can just sense, like, when that thing takes another second or two longer than it should, you know there's going to be... Chippy? Dude, ah, I just need to be able to snipe one, man. That's a good look. Okay, good temper there. My program, I'm going to the net. Ah, I was looking for the tip play. He ended up shooting instead. I wanted to get a shot on net. We got a 4-3 hockey game. I'm going to have to head to the bench. I have no energy left, and the game is going to be on the AI stick, which usually ends poorly. Please, no goals against. Just let us get out of here with the dub, and we do. The Columbus Blue Jackets back in the win column. A 4-3 victory. And after a tough start to this episode, you know, blowing a 2-0 lead, witnessing one of the weirdest glitches that I've ever seen, we end on a high, though. Finally, good victory for the boys. Rusty's still struggling to find the back of the net, but a win is a win. And we do have a mascot back on the ice when they should be on the ice this time. <laughs> Big win for the boys. Let's go. So the Columbus Blue Jackets end this episode with a 16-8-6 record. Honestly, not too shabby. What's most impressive is Johnny Hockey leading the National Hockey League stats here with 40 points. Followed by Patrick Kane and Sidney Crosby. What year is it? Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Be a Pro with Rostislav Nashrov. If you did, hit the video with a like. Hit that subscribe button. We are on the road to 1 milli. This was a crazy episode. And each episode, we see something new. So stay tuned. I'm out of here. We'll see you next time. And peace.